Hello everyone, I'm Alan from Yellow Tuxedo and today we're going to be talking about Instagram TV but specifically uploading to Instagram TV from your computer, your desktop because it's so easy. Um, as always with Yellow Tuxedo, if you enjoy what you watch and see with us, we'd love for you to give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and leave some comments below about what you're up to, what you think of Instagram TV and what you think of my dodgy shirt. No, don't, don't mention my shirt. Right, so Instagram TV. Some people seem to think that it's slowly dying. It didn't quite take off with the same amount of impetus as I think Instagram were hoping. They started it as a bit of a YouTube rival, but it's fair to say that hasn't happened. However, it still exists, it's still part of your Instagram account, so therefore it's a great way of sharing content for your followers, your likers, your subscribers to enjoy. And remember, like all other posts on Instagram, it is actually searchable by hashtags. So there's a couple of things to bear in mind. If you are uploading from your phone, you are limited to 10 minutes. However, if you upload via desktop, you're not limited to 10 minutes, you're limited to an hour. So let's have a look at how that works. Right, here we are on uh, Google, so we type in Instagram. Um, I'm already logged in, so we're gonna click on Instagram, and we're already logged on as Yellow Tuxedo here. Now, actually, it's a really good way on your desktop of just having a look what's going on. If, like me, you're a bit more of a desktop user than a phone user, I've got, I have no issues with a phone, but sometimes I just like a keyboard and a bigger screen. So if you are, it's a great way of having a look up and down. You can still comment, you can still love someone's post, you can still view stories and lots more. But today we're looking at Instagram TV specifically. So click on your account picture top right. Um, it's also worth bearing in mind here that you can absolutely edit your profile as well. Sometimes you might find that easier. I would recommend checking what that looks like on your phone because sometimes the formatting doesn't quite sit there. Right, let's delve into Instagram TV. So we are on our profile and we find Instagram TV there alongside from post, save, tagged. And here we go, here is our daily vlog that we're currently putting out and we're uploading. Um, and it, from here, it's really straightforward to upload. If you've created the files and you've created the artwork, then you just click on upload and you're taken to this screen here. So it says here, drag and drop a video file. Your video must be between one and 60 minutes, uh, long landscape portrait, an MP4, an MP4 file and less than 3.6 gig. Now, as we said, you don't need to be a verified account here. So last year in 2019, to upload over 10 minutes, you had to be a verified account. That doesn't exist anymore. To upload over 10 minutes, you just need to do it via desktop. And also, anything under one minute will just be a post in itself that doesn't need to go on Instagram TV. Right, so we are gonna add our file. I have edited it. It's another important fact here. It can be portrait or landscape. So yes, it's predominantly going to prefer portrait because it's gonna fill up the screen. However, if you're filming in landscape and you want to uh, upload in landscape, then you can. Now obviously, if you're just gonna record on your phone and press upload, then carry on with that. This is if you're recording on a separate device or you want to do a little bit of editing before you upload it on Instagram TV. Because if you then wanted to put it on your phone, you've got to get it from your computer back onto your phone. None of these things are difficult, but it's just extra steps when you can just do it natively on the desktop. Um, a key thing here, when it comes to the cover, it will just take the opening shot of the uh, film and take part of it. Now, we put uh, extra, you know, edited, created cover art on. There we go, Instagram TV. And what it does, so we've uploaded that. The dimensions I'm going to put in the uh, description below. Um, but what's important here is this bit here, post a preview. Previews appear on your profile and feed. Basically, they go into your grid. But what it does from the portrait cover here it takes the center square 
in your grid. So if you want something important, then make sure it's in the center because that way it will appear on your grid where you need it. Then add your title. So the art of travel and a song parody. Then you've got your description. Um, I normally write my stuff elsewhere, but just for the sake of this, this isn't the right description. I'm just gonna put that again. And this is what appears in your grid on your feed. And this is where you can add some hashtags. You don't need to put a dot there. Sometimes it just forces there to be a line. Other times it's not a problem, but you can absolutely put hashtags here up to 30 as normal it is in a feed, uh, you know, vlog, etc 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 hopefully you've got your hashtag bundles created and you can just copy and paste them in uh, once again we're apple users i am a fanboy don't judge me for it so i write all my stuff in notes that syncs between my phone and my macbook and therefore whether i'm on the desktop or whether i'm on my phone i can just copy and paste from notes and put it in wherever i need to put it into instagram um as you can see, it's uploading. It's gonna, you know, it's at 38%. It's gonna take a bit of time, depending on your, you know, your internet speed. And the key bit here, you can't schedule, but you can save draft. So I'm going to save draft there. It's uploading this, but that's fine. Because what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna open a new tab. I'm gonna go back into Instagram, because in true Blue Peter fashion, here's one I made earlier. I'm going back onto my account and my drafts, so back onto Instagram TV, my drafts are right there. So if you click on view drafts, the address for that is www.instagram.com forward slash TV forward slash drafts in case you want to find it. And there's my vlog I've already uploaded. Now I'm not gonna publish this, but I'm just gonna show you what you do. So you would click on that, click on edit video, and then it's already all there. The, the cover art we already saw, um, I've put my hashtags in, I've put my description, I've tagged a couple of people today, and then you click post, and that's it. So you can't schedule it, but you can post it. So key bits on this are, you can post up to an hour, it allows you to save it in draft, and they are all fab things to do when you're very, very busy, and you might wanna upload in the evening when the kids are in bed, or you're just sitting in front of the TV, and you don't wanna be doing that sort of stuff in the middle of the day. Right, thank you as always for watching today's video. We would love to hear what you think about Instagram TV in the comments below. Is it dying? Is it here to stay? Is it just gonna sit there not doing much, but you know, allowing us to post some content? Do let us know, have a fabulous day, and please give us a thumbs up. Bye now.